Hello everyone. Welcome back to RLL YouTube channel. In the previous video, we designed fabric parameter for meter using Zmax. Now in this video, I'm going to design a simple interferometer using Zmax. To design a simple interferometer, I'll need two beam splitters and two mirrors. One beam splitter will split the beam and the other will recombine. The other beam splitter will recombine those beam those will reflect from these mirrors. These mirror produce a shift. So let's start. Obviously we gonna need a source. I'm taking here a rectangular source. I am taking the layout trays below 100 you can take them 100 and the analysis rays 150k power is 1 watt which is ok now let's add the beam splitter in our design I'm going to place a 10 mm from the source and tilting it about 45 degrees. Material is PK7. The size, let's check it out how it looks. Yeah, it looks fine. Now I'm going to add two mirrors one for the transmitted rays and one for the reflected rays Now I'm placing it in upward direction so will I add, so I will add the Y position too. Let's check our design. Yeah, it's look okay. Now I'm gonna add a splitter in front of this other mirror so the both the rays coming from the mirror 1 and mirror 2 recombines and produce an interference pattern Okay, now let's add the detectors to check the interference pattern.
now our design looks perfectly fine now let's check the interference pattern what patterns we are getting on the screens by the way you can check also check the shaded model of our design here you can rotate the geometry and check So here you can see your fringes. The red fringe means that they are perfectly interfering, which you say con perfect constructive interference. The blue lines show the destructive interference, and the green lines show the partial interference. They are not completely interfering, they have a bit of phase difference. But yeah, there is interference. So, and the total power you can see 2.39 10 raised to power minus 1 watts. So, in this way, you can design a simple interferometer using ZMAX. Thank you for watching our video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.